Make we reason. I don't want nobody in 2019 send me messages after this live about who is my hair supplier and when I get my um my hair from yada yada yada. I don't want nobody to come to me with that in 2019 after this live. Alright, so yeah, I always have my <laughs> I always have my book and my pen as well. Now, before I get into the proposal, if you're gonna go into business, guys, you have to be willing to do the research, right? Um, research meaning if you're going into shoes, if you're going into clothes, if you're going into hair, if you're going into makeup, you just have to, the, the internet is there and there are people on the, in, on like Instagram and you know, platforms like that, that are doing the same thing as you, like you want to do. So you can just literally watch how they move, watch how them roll. It's not copying, but you're just learning from them. You understand so for instance I can tell you that I took three to four years before I decided on a supplier so if I took three to four years to decide on a supplier why the hell would you think me just gonna tell you like that talk truth talk the truth my know my don't hurt my know my can of rap and all of them someday but if I took three to four years because I'm very picky to decide on a supplier, why not take me just go telling her like that? It doesn't work like that here. And next thing, oh no, have this mentality that you have to have this big lump sum to start a business. No, you don't. Because if you don't have a man where willing to invest in you, if you don't born into a rich family, you probably just have to do what I'm about to tell you that I did. Now, um, when I took uh, the first chance to say, okay, and I tell everybody this, I can't give you a vendor list because I literally took one chance and that one chance worked for me. And it was just uh, instinct. That's the next thing. Go with your instinct, go with your gut feeling. When your mind tells you to do something, just do it. Don't, um, Doubt yourself, don't be like, what if, but if you get a strong feeling to make a move, just move. That's very important. So, I got this email and um, I had a strong feeling to just move. So, um, this was the first time actually spending um, a good amount to test to see if the samples were good. And as I said before, you can apply this to any um, industry that you're interested in, whether it's makeup or whatever. Yeah, so I tested it and I was pleased, right? So I'm like, great, let me just um, wear it myself, see if it works for me, and then I can go ahead with this supplier. And this is three years after me um, contemplating whether I should sell here or not. And then what pushed me is that I was referring clients to suppliers in Jamaica, like hair dealers in Jamaica, and they must spend some good, like one person has spent like some good 60 or thousand just to purchase the hair. And I'm like, what the fuck? I mean, this money could be coming into me instead of me referring them to a hair dealer. So I'm like, no, kids, no, 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 no. So like, as soon as like my clientele pick up, I may say, but look how many give them people here, how much clients for buy here, and you know, they could buy it from me. And then if you're a hairstylist in this live, you have the upper hand. You have the upper hand against the hair dealers because straight off the bat, uh, clients already trust you with selling hair because they're the first thing they might ask, um, where can I purchase the hair? Because they already trust you as a hair stylist. Majority of the time when I get a call, somebody is saying, um, where can I buy the hair from? And then Mahafia refer them to somebody when I could have just said, listen, I have the hair right here, honey. 
So, moving along to the next step that I'm saying you can start small and earn big. And that's my little tagline for the proposal that I have for you guys who keep asking me who is my supplier. Start small. I started with 10 bundles, 12 inch straight. Let me repeat. I started with 10 bundles, 12 inch straight. Now, a lot of people, if they want to get in the hair business, they're like, Lord, they want 12 inch, they want 14 inch, they want 18 inch, they want whatever, whatever. And you're trying to appeal to everybody. But as a stylist, I know that majority of my clients, because virgin hair is not cheap, majority of my clients go for a natural look, which is between 10 to 16 inch. So I know so the 12 inch they must sell. Yes, buying too much stock. Yeah, because guess what? They're just like a sit on pile. And then you have to try sell them. Mm -mm. So 10 inch, um, 10 bundles of 12 inch straight. I'm not even bother mix them. I say, I'm not even bother mix them. I say, oh, more body we ever more deep we ever more this and more that. I say, no, you are the only big woman. I think mood attacked. How oh, this man? A business we are talking about 2019. A money we are talking about. You are for later. Anyways. But how much that cost me? But it was less than $500. If it wasn't $500, it was less than $500. Right? And say for instance, um, that's probably 50 grand or let's say 40 or 50 grand. Let's say. And everybody knows say. <laughs> everybody knows say 12 inch probably go for like. 7500 right off the bat you spend 50 grand you gain $25,000 by selling each bundle for 7500 right so <laughs> but the key thing is me as a hairstylist i pretended that that bundle money it never exists it never exists at all. So, if you're doing something, if you're at a 9 to 5, you see a side hustle, if you're starting up your side hustle, pretend like that money doesn't exist. Don't put it in your regular account. Put it in a different account. And you know, say, listen, that bundle the money there, may I put it in an account there, may not touch it. Maybe you don't even want to get a card for it because it's just straight deposits because you have to keep building on that profit. So for the persons who are just joining, I'm telling you, I started with 10 bundles, 12 inch straight. And why I did that, why I did 10 bundles, 12 inch straight, because everybody knows that you only need like two bundles per person. <laughs> You're welcome. Everybody knows that you only need two bundles per person to do a head at 12 inch so listen now so if you only need two bundles per person at 12 inch that's five people you need to sell to so make sure everybody in here can find five people to sell two bundles each and then you'll make your first um profit off that first investment that you make five people and with those five people the five people that i sold to i took that money and i put it in a separate account and i did not touch that shit you see a side hustle if you're starting up your side hustle pretend like that money doesn't exist don't put it in your regular account put it in a different account and you know say listen that bundle the money there May I put it in an account there? May not touch it. Maybe you don't even want to get a card for it because it's just straight deposits because you have to keep building on that profit. So for the persons who are just joining, I'm telling you, I started with 10 bundles, 12 inch straight. I started the 10 bundle thing in summer, right? I tried my first 10 bundles in summer and then I kept flipping it I kept flipping it. So each time I sell it off, I buy a little more. 
what the hell? Each time I sell, each time I sell it off, each time I sell off the batch, um, I purchase a little bit more, but not, not too much that you're eating out your profit. Okay, not too much. Don't OD. And I can tell you that, say for instance, if I started with an investment of fifty thousand dollars in July. In December, before I left Jamaica, that account was almost 500000 My little story of starting small and earning big, you have to be patient, you have to be disciplined. Nobody eat out the money. Please, nobody eat out the money. Set my prices, people were like, you know, you're expensive, but I know what I'm paying for the hair and I know the effort that I put into the wigs and I know how much the supplies cost for me to make your wigs. So I know why I set my price like that. And if you're like, a, you must know who you're targeting because I'm targeting people who want quality because people who want quality are going to return people who want stuff that are cheap. They're not loyal. So you must know if you want people who are loyal or if you want people who are cheap and will bounce about everywhere and you have to be keep getting new clients. Because if you go, um, like you'd go small profit or whatever because you're going really cheap. If I was going really cheap, Ono couldn't cost me if there was, um, if there was any issue with Ono here, you know. If I was going really cheap, Ono couldn't cost me if any issue is going on with your hair. Because guess what? You know how much you pay for it. So you you get what you give. Don't let anybody tell you you're too expensive. If you set your price, you must know what your value is. Don't let anybody tell you that you're too expensive. Because if I went with... Yeah, if I went with what people were saying when I just launched my site, saying, oh, you're too expensive. And the fact that I wasn't getting any sales, I would have legit dropped my prices and then I would have been losing. And if you're selling products, you say like, oh, come on now, I'm going to wrap with you now. People will more trust me um, because I am trying to be transparent with you guys. You see, when you go on a page and when you look on the page, you're just seeing just reposts of products that they find on the internet. You don't see the actual person behind the company. People don't really trust that. They want transparency. They want to see who is behind the page, no matter, no matter if you're selling pencils, if you're selling um canvases if you're selling anything that you're selling they want to see who is behind the page they want to know who them sending their money to now page open because i'm not like a shy person you know what I'm, I'm not a shy person but if you but but i distinctly I distinctly um, have a business page and a personal page. So if you don't want to see my antics sometime, go on over to the business page. You don't have to follow my personal page if you don't want to see my antics. Hi, Bean. So I'm telling you from now, if you don't, don't want to see my antics and if you don't want to see me, I chat up from my mouth. But majority of the time, I'll be posting work. But separate your personal page from your business page. <laughs> help not only persons who are interested in hair it can help you to gather additional income so that when you get that lump sum after not touching the money when you get that lump sum saved up you can now do this and you build up a certain amount of money in your savings you can finally invest it into whatever you want to invest it in because remember we now have a sugar daddy we now have no rich parents so we have to start small and earn big so maybe you're not interested in here but this could be a stepping stone for you to make money to invest into whatever you want to do in reality
the proposal is a cure starter kit right the cure starter kit uh it basically gives you an opportunity to start small and earn big with the same 10 bundles that i was telling you about how i started and why i came up with that idea is because i get so many people in my inbox asking me for my supplier no managa you know the supplier but I'll give you that same opportunity to invest that same fifty thousand dollars or four hundred. It's not even fifty, but four hundred and odd dollars to get ten bundles. Find five people to sell it to, get a little profit, and then you keep adding on to that profit. And then when you get, when you build up that profit in the, that saving account to maybe the the 500,000 that i had if you want to go in makeup if you want to go in clothing if you want to go full force in hair if you want to go into um nails or whatever you want to do you would have saved up a lump sum from what you had invested to know branch off into the business that you really want to do if it's not here and why i say start a kit because it's just a way <laughs> welcome why i say start a kit it's just a way for you to earn additional income your starter kit is already on the website it's package the 10x package package gives you 10 bundles the same length and you can choose the texture so remember i told you guys that i started with 10 bundles 12 inch straight and i found five people i found five people to sell that to so let's get into the numbers the 10x package is 425 right that's 10 bundles of um say 10 inch or whatever 12 inch let's talk us first and then we can talk jamaican because i know i have a lot of jamaican followers so, so let's just talk usd first now if you say all right you're gonna spend 425 on 10 bundles right and then you're gonna sell back the bundles at 60 dollars each let me repeat you spend 425 but you're going to resell each bundle, 10 bundles, $60 each. That's $600 in your first batch. If you're in Jamaica, the rate is about one thirty, So that's like probably 55000 or whatever. And when I was in Jamaica, a 12-inch bundle was like 7500 I'm not sure if it... If it decrease with the amount of sellers that are in Jamaica, I don't know if it increase. But say for instance, you have you resell each bundle at seven thousand five hundred. Ten bundles, and you just spent fifty fifty five thousand dollars. How much that? How much that in the first batch? How much? And when you get that profit, you do not touch it. Take okay. what if they need three bundles? If they need three bundles, oh yeah, I didn't go. It's not just a 10x package. There is a bundle remix package as well. Because remember, the 10x package gives you 10 bundles the same length. The remix package gives you um the option to mix the lengths right the bundles remix package gives you the option to mix the lengths and how i designed it is that if you're going 20 inches and up then you will need three bundles well glad you asked that too i came prepared for your questions no if you want to go further if you want to go further and offer 
bundle um closures as well remember you know guys i never start off with no closure i start out with 10 bundles so anybody with me i sell the, the two bundle them two them trying to buy the one no closure coming out no closure for selling no <laughs> but if you have a little extra money that you can actually invest in getting um closures and frontals there's a little package for that as well. Remember, um, it's a 5X package. <laughs> There's a 5X package for the frontals and for the closures. Yeah, me know, me know people, the people that want them closure and them frontals. So that's why I'm going to get a package. That's why I'm going to do the package for them. All right. Now, the 5X package... Yeah, package for everything. Listen, I'm come prepared for the backside. <laughs> the five X package, right? Gives you five. Remember, it's just a starter kit. It gives you five closures, or if you want the frontal package, it gives you five frontals, right? I have like two minutes remaining. It was an awesome live, and so let me just do a recap in the two minutes. Um, the 10x package get 10 bundles same length the bundles remix you can mix the lengths it's on the site now so you can check it out um, the closure the closure the closure deals right um five closures or five frontals and if you have any questions after this you can let me know but it's just a stepping stone to hey lady moya it's just a stepping stone so that you can accumulate the funds like i did and invest in the business that you desire for 2019 Mwah!